Yes, welcome back to my uh, memories of the past as we discuss what happened back when we invaded Draenor. My goodness, those years were long gone. I remembered something, though. I had actually put this helmet on, the, the helmet that I'd received from the quest. I didn't, uh, I didn't put it in my inventory or my bag and say, nah. So anyway, where were we last? Oh, yes, those two young dwarves, Hansel and Thalen, uh, they had asked me to, uh, well, blow some stuff up. <laughs> and as you know, I'm all about that blowing things up. <laughs> you think you can handle me, you old black block, 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 block. Machinist, machinist, Jesus, what is wrong with my speaking today? I cannot talk. That's okay. It has been a hard-fought battle today. Bucky, please stop staring at me while I'm fighting this battle. You're making me creeped out. Well, I guess that's what we needed for Thalen. All those schematics. All right, over here. Hello. Need some help? Oh, I guess not. Good job. High five you. Hector, huh? I don't know you, Hector, but you did well. Let's take this black rock powder keg and just get out of here. Did you hear that? Bucky, did you hear it? Get your face out of that barrel, Bucky. All right, here we are. We've got your barrel, Thalen. Here you are. I'm the finest words in all. Uh, there's your schematics. Mm. Mm, yeah, simple enough. The dwarf flips through the pages and no longer seems to notice your presence. Okay. Here we are. Oh, excuse me. Oh, push this, shall we? Hmm. There she goes. Oh, oh, oh. Wait for it. Waiting Come for it. Wow. Oh, ha, ha. Marvelous, Hansel. Oh, that a prettiest thing? I agree. Beautiful. Here, take this barrel off my back, please. Alright, and we have to help the do the Farseer. He wanted us to find one of his tribe members. I believe she was, he was over here somewhere. Oh, look at the lovely scenery over here. Ah, you there. I haven't fought anyone much today. Have that. Oh, there you are. I knew I'd recognize one of Drakthar's people. Nah. The orc's lips and wrists quiver with their strained fury. Who are you? Wait, what's that you say? Drekthar is here? These stinking black rock cowards think they're humiliating me. They're just making me angrier. Overseer Gotrick, in the hut over there, carries my shackle key. If I'm going to get out of here, I'm going to need that key. Then... Vengeance can begin. Huh. Well, I will, buddy. That sounds marvelous. Wait one as I go get your key. Ha <laughs> he will make a He'll make a fine addition to our battle. Gotrig, I have a shield with your name on it. Oh, ho, ho. Gotrig? He said he was over here, right? Is that him? Ah, that is him. Hello, Gotrig. Have my shield. Ah, have at thee. Have another shield in your face. Shield bash you to the wind. Have a nice shield. Uh, come on, knock it off. Just die already. I'm here to deliver a message for you, Gotrig. The message is... You shouldn't have done that. <laughs> ah. Now we have the shackle key in hand. We'll make our way out of this place. It smells of black rock orc. Ugh. Ah. Come, Valiant. I, I think I said that twice. Oh well. Oh, Gnar, I have your key. <laughs> oh, fling that poo, Gnar. There you go. Oh. I can get back to Drakthar myself. After I ran, run this stinking shovel through a few black rock stomachs. Indeed, sir. Free at last. I swear by the spirit of my father, I will make them pay. Ha <laughs> ha! Make sure they do. 
think I need to wash my hands. I will meet you back at your camp. All right, Gunnar. If that's what you feel you must do, you must do. All right, I shall see you then. Ah, Valiant, what a lovely stroll in the park. Ah, those days were fun. Gunnar was a worthy, worthy ally. I tell you, he managed to kill so many of those black rocks. Hello, Drexar. You have my thanks, Joffrey. Duratan, our chieftain, will be happy to hear that Gnar lives. Indeed, I'm sure he shall. Okay. Huh. Does anyone else need my help? Oh, Cadgar! Cadgar, my friend Cadgar, how are you? Hmm. We cannot risk the re reactivation of the Dark Portal. Now it's time for the death blow. Thalen should have figured out how to get that tank working by now. Take him with you and turn that tank against the Dark Portal itself. We will follow behind you. Ha <laughs> ha! Thalen! Oh, dwarf after my own heart. Oh, Thalen, my friend! I hear you have uh, some things to do. Hmm? Need some of the. Yes, I need your help. Sounds like a plan, Thalen. Let us away, my friend. Oh, Bucky, I wish you talked more often. Look back there. Think we can climb up those chains. Oh, a grand plan, my friend. You there, Gogluck. Have a shield in your face. Ah. What, you think you can handle my righteous fury? You can't even handle this. Oh, well, apparently you're, uh... Not stunned by my beauty like the other people are. Huh. No worries. Let's get out of here. Ah, stop shooting me in the butt. I don't want to fight you again. What's the matter, Grogleg? Can't get up here. Oh, he, he's trying. He's definitely trying to get up here. Oh. I don't have enough room up here to get away. Oh, this might end up badly. Ow. Ah. What? You think you can best me? You can't best me. I'm too good for this. Get off my cannon, you fool! Huh. Uh, come on. I've battled worse than you before in my time. You're nothing compared to some of the dragons I've taken out. Uh, be gone, you fool. You fiend. Uh, get out of here. Uh, uh, that was a hard-fought battle, Grogling. Uh, I'm not even going to pronounce your name correctly. All right, Thalen, what are we looking at here? Hmm? Need something? Yes, I uh, talked to you for a reason. This, I can work with this. Do we have see it? There are two ways of keeping the stock from going through the portal. Break the tank or use the dark tank to blow the dark portal. I could, excuse me, I can get her working. I just need time. Open the tower and store for Brian and get more of my back. Ah, sounds like a plan, my friend. Looks like oh. we arrived just in time. Hop into that turret. I'll see if I can get this thing going. Kaka, buy me some time. We will do what we can, Thalen. This will be Kaka, easy, Thalen. These orcs off of us. I will, Kagar. Have no fear. Ah, let's see. But nope, that was on you guys. Sorry. Don't worry. I'm sure you'll be fine. Nice shot. Thanks. I'm getting good at this. It's not quite my shield, but I do not mind chucking these bombs at people. Ha <laughs> ha ha! Here, have that. Tank coming over the rise. Look out! Thanks, Yorel. I'll take care of this tank. Little did I know that tank was a bit of a jerk. Ow! Stop chucking bombs at me! I am the great mighty Joffrey, don't you know? Oh, another tank. More tanks? No tank, you. Oh my god. That is the worst joke I've told so far. Oh my. They're bringing up 
explosives. Destroy those cunts before they get close. Explosives too? Ha ha ha! No match for me. A little cart full of explosives against my cannon? Ha ha! Will you stop shooting me? Ugh. Get out of here, you orcs. Here, have that. Please tell me you're gone now. I'm tired of freaking dodging your bombs. Sorry, Dalen, my tank, my... My cannon's gone. Ha ha! Sounds perfect! No worries, my friend. Shall I, uh... Shall I push this giant red button here? Oh, that's a wrecked hit! Yes! Good job there, Thalen! Ha ha ha! Wait a minute. Wasn't that our only way home? Uh-oh. Those fellas look very intimidating. Hi, Thrall. I, uh, I think it may be time for us to beat a hasty retreat. A tactical withdrawal, as it were. What's on your mind? Ah, take on away Goldon was one of thing. But blowing up the whole darn portal? That's my kind of solution. Nah, I think we'd better get out of here before they get the army gets us. I agree, my friend Thalen. If they weren't so angry before, they sure are now. We won't survive a minute on top of this thing. Tank, let's join up with the rest when we got out of here. Very well. Yes, let's away, my friend Dalen. Oh, I fell. Ow. Ah, oh, Jesus. We've got all, I mean, by the nine. My, no, that's the wrong one. By the divines. By the light. There we go. <laughs> I knew which divinity I was praying to. Let us away. I think there is. Shut up, Gromash. Oh, that was... Oh, that was one heck of a run. Hey, Khadgar. Against all odds, here we stand, still alive. An entire army at our heels. Our ship is waiting. Shall we depart? So yes, my it. friend. Let's get underway, then. We will need to build a stronghold if we hope to end the Iron Horde threat. And we're going to need help from the natives. Then perhaps we shall be friendly to the natives, then. Ha ha ha! We shan't attack. Fine, just yell while I'm talking, doesn't matter. I feel like I'm floating, I don't know why. So, what's Shadow Moon anyway? Sounds ominous. Huh. Well, we seem to have run aground, but we're all safe and sound. Oh, you look fairly impressive, my friend. Hey, one sec. I feel odd. I feel like there's something strange about my head. Ah, much better. I don't even know what it was, but it's gone now. Hello, oh, Prophet Felon. The Prophet welcomes you with a curious look, then a warm nod. So it begins. I would assume so, sir. So you are the one that has led my children home. I have been waiting for you. The Iron Horde goes stronger every day. I have foreseen a great battle, but my visions are clouded. It's as if time is sitting on top of itself. One thing is certain. Your presence here is of great importance. The light will guide you. Well, away. when you put it that way. This hero and many others from another world have come to it aid us. It is good to see you, my child. My people welcome your aid, champion. Come with me. Yes, come, Valiant. Prophet. I must warn you, the Iron Horde intends to strike out against all who oppose them. We must Sounds... prepare our defenses. We will deal with one problem at a time. First, <coughs> we must settle your people. I would like a place to lay my head and check my mail, sir. It has been so long since I walked the lands of Shadow Moon. My god, it was a wonderful, wonderful, beautiful dark place, but still so beautiful. Here, this location commands the entrance to our valley. 
Hmm. Not much, but I think we can work with it. We waiting for everyone else? Yeah, we are. Hey, Maraud, my old friend. Stand? This will have to do. We wouldn't have survived then and without your strength, Geoffrey. Many Draenaian alliance alike owe you a great debt. Before we departed for the Dark Portal, King Rin personally recommended that I place you in charge of our operations here with Draenor. After seeing you in action, I am inclined to agree. This is your garrison to found. Plant the banner and will begin construction immediately, Commander. Well, that sounds wonderful, sir. Plant your banner and claim your destiny. Haha! <laughs> I shall plant it right here, where this shiny one is. Poof! Haha! <laughs> I can open up a portal to Stormwind only briefly. Really? Only I briefly? I hope my trust in your people is not misplaced. Haha, <laughs> you don't have to I worry, sir. You, my prophet. The commander we've chosen represents the very best of the Alliance. Right, yes. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> Zip Fizzle, how are you? This is it, boys. Let's break some ground and take this world for the Alliance. He doesn't speak for us, by the way. <laughs> is that a pug? Is that Shelly's pug? Huh. Weird. Ah. Uh, hey, Alexa. Hello, Commander. So this is Draenor. A bit darker than expected. Still, after building Stormwind, this project should be a walk in the park. Well then, are you ready to begin, Commander? Yes. Some of the trees around here look small enough to make that the workers should be able to down them in no time. We can leave the hard labor to Shelley's men, but if you'd be willing to mark the trees for them to start with, we should be able to get this operation rolling much faster. If you ah. those trees, Shelly's lumberjacks will do the rest. I believe. I know Shelly's got some very dedicated people. Did you see that? There's a gigantic raven just past the tree line. I'm not getting anywhere near that. In fact, I'm not sure any of the men are sufficiently equipped to deal with that threat. What are you doing? Do you want to handle this one yourself, Commander? One of those ravens have gone... Once those ravens are gone, we can start sending more troops into the woods. So we'll be killing two birds with one stone. Or should I say, five birds with... Confused by his own analogy, Barrow scratches his head. You get the point. For the Come iron on. killer ravens, I have a feeling it's <coughs> going to be a long, cold night. Now, I shall handle them quite sadly, my friend. <coughs> huh. What is this shiny thing here? Oh, yes. Marking trees. You! Knock it off! Leave him alone! He wants to be an ape, let him be an ape! Uh, killing ravens. One step up above killing rats, but you know. It's a job, and it has to get done. Jerk. Uh, I think we should have Bucky out here doing this. Ha ha ha! That's so raven. I don't even understand that reference. But it was funny. Ah, this is a nice tree. Oh. There's a graveyard apparently already here. Uh, I think we'll wait till we go say hi to you, sir. Well, there's one thing you can say for the ravens of this country. They are much bigger than the ravens back in Azeroth. <laughs> Get out of here. Huh. Get out of here. You. Leave me alone. Get out of here. Go! Be gone! I don't want to make that guy angry. He's a big fella. He could probably squish me pretty easily. Huh. One more tree ought to do nicely. Here we are. Leave me alone. You are so annoying. Leave me alone. That's enough trees. Alright, come Valiant, let us away. You there, sir. Orders, Commander. We got the trees. An excellent choice of lumber, if I do say so myself. And we got the birds. Impressive work, Commander. Of I course. Know I'll sleep a lot better without those giant killer birds flying around. Indeed, coward. Hey, Yurel. Let me uh not park my horse on top of you. Faith is my mirror, but I'm... will is my weapon. I'm getting reports of a giant in the forest. A few of the carbor car carbor peacekeepers. I followed it into a cave. In all honesty, I don't think any of our troops are willing to engage the beast. 
Maybe you could investigate? I'm sure the peacekeepers would appreciate the help. Please be careful. Well, I did say I would come back for him later. Ah, oh well. I was expecting to have to face this beast at one point. Hello, gentlemen. Cowards. He is a large fellow. But nothing I can't handle. Ha ha! Have at thee, beast! Yeah, have this. Consecrate the ground. Maybe I can hit you in the head. Yes! You aren't immune. I can knock your noggin in and then beat you up soundly. Excuse me, sir. I am busy hitting you with my axe and shield. How dare you jump like a monkey? Ugh. Take that. Have at thee, sir. The light is on my side. The light doesn't care anything for you, fell beast, with your rocks and your shininess. Oh, if only I knew a jewel crafter who could work with your jewels. Ha ha ha! I would sell them quite nicely on the auction house. Oi. Die, evil, quake feast, fist. Ah, finally. We have managed to defeat them all. Well, it all. There was only one. <coughs> Though perhaps we could maybe make the tail a little wider. Ha <laughs> ha Perhaps there was actually... Oops, sorry. Perhaps there was actually 40 little rock beasts. Now, that's a little unbelievable. Maybe there was just 10 of them. 10 giant rock monsters. Yes, that would be perfect. Ha <laughs> ha Oh, Yorel. Well, put my horse away. Hello, Yorel. What is happening to this world? The base is significantly more secure with that giant dead. You have made quite an impression on the peacekeepers. I'm happy to hear that, Yorel. giant defeated, we shouldn't have any more trouble clearing out the area. I agree. That was fairly easy. <laughs> All 20 of those giant rock monsters died. Oh. Hey, Barros. What do you need? I'm impressed with how quickly you've pulled the group together, Commander. I think it's time we start putting up some walls and establishing a firm perimeter around our base. You hesitate too often when you talk. We've got a lot of work to do. Have you seen Brightstone, my latest assistant? It's more than a handful. Oh, stop talking. Oh, we have everything we need. It's time to build the garrison. Through your selfless actions, you have earned the respect of my people. They have granted you this foothold. <coughs> to victory. Commander. Ooh. I like the sound of that. Call me Commander again, my friend. Well, this is quite a lovely, lovely outpost we have established here. But, that is where we are going to leave my story for tonight. I hope you all have enjoyed this story I've told you. This is how our garrison was established in the footholds of Draenor, in the Shadowmoon Valley, as the four warlords sought to bring about the return of the Burning Legion. But anyway, thank you all so much for sitting for my tale. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I mean, enjoy the show and whatnot. Anyway, take care. Good night, ladies and gentlemen.